So exactly what is video blogging and or what other uses that could I make of video socials and recording short videos? Hi, I'm Mark Bullock with videosocials.net and phoneblogger.net. And I thought I'd take just a moment to explain what a video blog is and what else you could use these videos for. So when you're trying to get content out to a potential audience, whether it be an audience that knows you likes you and trusts you already, or whether or not you're trying to reach a new audience or you're trying to expand your audience. Um, it's all about content nowadays. So you need to get information that's valuable to them and interesting to them and educational for them out onto social media, out through newsletters, out through your website, as an example. We say three minutes for that purpose because people have very short attention spans and don't tend to want to watch longer videos unless it's truly an instructional type video where you're showing a series of processes and things. And we've all seen these on YouTube as an example. But a video blog really is not a home of information. It's not a long in-depth uh, explanation of something. It's kind of bite-sized information, a little bit longer than perhaps a Q&A or a frequently asked question on your website, um, but not a full length, full of information article that takes, you know, half an hour to consume. So um, that's the reason for the three minutes, but you don't have to use that whole three minutes. And the reason that, that I say that is, is you may be doing a 30 second ad as an example for Facebook or for anything uh, for that matter. And you're welcome to record. 30 seconds and have us time you and do it in a 30 in a 30 second period um as a matter of fact we have members that have that have done that um the other thing one of the other things that you can do with your videos is you can create introduction videos for your website whether it be introdu introducing a product or a service or introducing yourself or introducing the website itself of course if you're going to do any kind of event you want to do a video to introduce that event and it get, again, get that out on social media, et cetera. That might take a minute, it might take three, but basically we're not telling you how long it needs to be. In short, it's whatever you want the video to be used for, it's your choice. We just give you a three minute window to do it within. And of course we don't pull you off the screen at three minutes if you go, if you go a few seconds over, we just let you know that it's time to wrap up so that you can, uh, you can try to stay within that shorter time frame for those shorter attention spans online. So again, events, video blogs, introductions, and basically training of any type um, that you're introducing and trying to get some information, again, that's valuable and educational for your audience. Again, Mark with videosocials.net, phoneblogger.net. Have a great day.